We're talking about marriage, two committed people, to make sure they have a secure family. And all we have to do is vote yes. House lawmakers passed a bill this week protecting same-sex marriage rights amid fears that a recent Supreme Court ruling on abortion could undermine them. The Respect for Marriage Act even attracted the support of 47 Republicans. GOP Congresswoman Nancy Mace said gay couples should have the right to be as, quote, miserably married as straight couples. Now the bill will move to the Senate, where Democrats will need 10 Republicans to join them in turning the measure into law. Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer said he was encouraged by the bipartisan support the Respect for Marriage Act got in the House. This legislation is so important. I was really impressed by how much bipartisan support it got in the House. It passed 267 to 157, 47 Republicans, about a quarter, a little less than a quarter of their caucus, maybe a fifth, voted for the bill. Schumer also said he's working to get the bill to the floor. The new bill seeks to repeal the Defense of Marriage Act, or DOMA, which Bill Clinton signed into law in 1996. DOMA codified marriage as between a man and a woman. While a Supreme Court case later ruled that unconstitutional, many Democrats are concerned that the conservative majority on the court could undo that ruling. It's unclear whether the Respect for Marriage Act will advance in the Senate. But the push to get it passed reflects the new political environment created by the Supreme Court's decision to overturn Roe v. Wade and allow states to outlaw abortion. Sarah Westwood for The Washington Examiner.